2011, we introduced 100G for the Metro. This was an industry first, something that nobody else had ever done before. Since its launch, we've traveled the globe showcasing this technology to carriers and enterprises. And each time we show it, there's only one response. Now, we want to show you what is so special about this technology and why we are so excited about its possibilities. Our 100G Metro solution is based on four key efficiencies. Cost, space, power and spectral. The purpose of this demo is to show you how easily you can leverage these four efficiencies to answer your bandwidth demands and to drive new business opportunities. To do this, we'll be using several pieces of equipment. Two laptops to show you how the data is being transported, two FSP3000 chassis containing 200G Metro cards and the respective filters, transmission fiber to transport the data, and that's it. For us, this card is all about simplicity. There are no hidden tricks, no hidden complexities. We believe networking is all about plug and play simplicity. Okay, now let's get started. Let's begin with the command line interface. This is where you manage each service. We go to the service manager and log into the chassis that hosts the 100G Metro card. When we log into the card, you're able to see each individual port with its data rate, whether it's 10 gigabit Ethernet, 8 gig fiber channel, STM64 or OC192. Scroll down to the bottom here and you can see the four network ports, each with 28 gig capacity of traffic. Aggregated, this is 100G. Let's see how the FSP3000 is configured. Here we can see the 100G Metro card. What's incredible about this card is that it's only two slots wide. Two slots for 100G capacity. We believe this is something to be really excited about. Here we see the four wavelengths coming out of the 100G Max Ponder card being fed into a four-channel filter module, which in turn feeds the actual transmission fiber. At the other side, the traffic will be demultiplexed in another filter module and fed as four wavelengths into the receiving 100G Max Ponder card. For this demo, there are two types of traffic. A notebook streaming a video connected to one of the 10 gigabit ports and a 10 gigabit ethernet tester connected to another 10 gig port with the traffic looped at the other side. Now, when I connect the line cables, we'll see the video being transported across the link. Let me show you the throughput here on the tester. This shows 100% of 10 gig received. This, together with the video signal, represents only 20% of the capacity though. If we were to add another 8 times 10 gig clients, we will be transporting 100 gig worth of traffic. Now, it is important to remember how power efficient this card is. 100 watts for a fully configured 100 gig card. 100 watts for 100 gig. That's less than 10 watts for 10 gig service. Less than 1 watt for 1 gig of transport. These figures are amazing. Remember, once you plug in this card, you have two and a half times better spectrum efficiency on your fiber plan than with existing 10 times 10G solutions. Think for a moment how this will extend the lifetime of your infrastructure. Now, there's one more thing. If you have a 40 gig client that you want to transport, we can provide you with a translation cable that takes the 40 gig SR4 interface and breaks it out into 4 times 10 gig which we transport over 100G Metro Max Ponder. Now, if you want to see more of this demo, email me, srettenberger at adfaoptical.com.